Hi YouTube, welcome to my channel. Today I decided to put two videos into one for this Halloween event for the update of Kim Kardashian gameplays. For this month, I did not post, but I'm going to put all the videos into one except for one I'm going to be posting on Halloween. A very, very special other video that will be separate from this one. It will be coming out on Halloween, so don't forget to subscribe and stay tuned for this video and others to come. Happy holidays, guys. Even though Halloween isn't a holiday anymore. But, as you can see on this icon, we got an update. Period! It's a pumpkin! And we are going to be Snow White today. I have three other outfits I'm going to be picking for this month. But yeah, part. Let's go ahead and see what's happening with Olivia. Oh, there's a coffin and stuff. I kind of remember this stuff from last year. Miss Lady, I have amazing news. What is it, boo? Because of you, Kim, and let's face it, my dad too, I was able to meet the best fashion designers in the world. After speaking with them and proving that I'm truly passionate about the craft, I was able to convince them to come and speak to my entire fashion design class. <gasps> they were amazing and so inspirational. They spent the whole day helping everyone in my class. It felt great to be able to do that for everyone and pay for with the opportunity that you gave me. Aw, that's sweet. Speaking of my time at the Fashion Design Academy, I've completed my first Evan Fashion collection. Kind of dark, elegant, mysterious, and a little edgy, but mostly it's different. Different how? You'll see soon, or at least I hope you'll see it very soon if you agree to something. Kim gave me a wild marketing idea to build buzz and anticipation for the reveal of my first collection. I'm listening. Okay, imagine yourself wearing my signature design at all the hottest clubs, but you're also wearing a mask. No one knows who you are and keep the mysterious up by not saying anything to anyone about who designed what you're wearing. Ew, a mysterious model, huh? That's the idea. I owe it all to Kim. Once we create enough buzz and people are really wondering, we can debut my first fashion line as a professional fashion designer. Sounds great, boo. You do you. Hey bestie, you're going to make such a great secret model for Olivia. I'll do my best. How are you these days? Girl, you don't care. I see you making these big moves and, make, and working hard on all these campaigns. I'm so proud of you. But take a day off to focus on yourself and the people you love. Make sure you get enough rest for your best self. Thanks, Kimmy. I'm here for you, bestie. Let's hug her. You know what? Let's just do it. <laughs> hey, you. Yeah, you. Who are you under that mask? It's a secret. I'm not supposed to be saying nothing. Ugh, whatever. You know what? It doesn't even matter who you are. Who made the outfit of yours I want. What? Are you messing with me? Do you even know who I am? Tell me who designed your outfit is now. It's a secret. Whoa. Bro, you can tell, definitely see that's me. Oh, she got mad. I don't care. Yo, that's kind of dope. I like that. Go off. Ooh, I pulled that off. Miss Eddie, you must have really gotten under um, Willow's skin because not revealing your outfit design. Willow has been all over social drawing attention to the outfit you wore. The meaning answers and the witty bringing Olivia's design a lot of buzz. We're off to a good start, so let's keep it up tomorrow. I forgot to give him an um, English accent. My bad. Miss Lady, Mr. Casio recently won a big motorcycle race and he invited you to. <gasps> mm, 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 mm. Unfortunately, he won't recognize you in the outfit you're wearing. <gasps> you need to keep building the buzz. Mm. I'm going to attend the party to help you and express your exp apologies for not being able to make it. Mm. My baby, he'll be like, oh my gosh, you didn't come. She's not interested in me. I am. I am, boo. Hello and welcome to my club, Mysterious Stranger. Flirt wave. I admit you look quite stunning in this outfit, but please understand, 
There is someone I have my heart set on. It's so pretty. <laughs> I'm sorry. Do not indulge your charm. If only they were here tonight. If I wink. <gasps> here he is. I want him to know that it's me. I don't care. Wait a minute. Miss Lady, is that you? I recognize your eyes anywhere. Shh. Oh, yes. You're keeping up this mysterious act. I understand. <gasps> don't worry, Miss Lady. You're taking your safe with me. Blow a kiss. I don't care if nobody sees. Oh, my God. He is so... Oh, my God. Y'all, this is... Can we have a baby with him? Hello, this is the first time I'm seeing Olivia's latest design. It looks great. You're modeling it to perfection. Because that's what I do at the end of the day. Miss Lady, the event at 10 AX was a big success. That's what I like to hear. You've been doing a good job getting the buzz going. Soon it will be time for Olivia to reveal herself as a designer at the upcoming fashion events. Before that, you and Olivia will need to get some promotional photos taken. I'll call you later for the details. We're gonna get our picture taken, period. And then we're gonna be um, styling profiling. Mm. And then we're gonna like, reveal to the world. What? Tomorrow. You're absolutely rocking my collection, Miss Lady. Thank you for being a secret model and working up all this buzz. It certainly paid off, totally. Suri actually mentioned to me she's the only one who figured out the outfit was my design. We might be working together very soon. I'm so excited. Things are taking off for me, and I'm fully aware it's because of the opportunities I've had in life. That's why I'm going to make it my mission to bring my fellow fashion design classmates to get noticed too. I'm also donating half of all the money I make. Aww. That's why I want my career to be about lifting those less fortunate up those through my success as a fashion designer. I want to do this same exact thing in real life. Like, I want to like be able to become successful where I can help other people who are in dire needs because there were definitely times where I was in dire needs and I really needed that help. So I would love to give back. And Olivia have proven to be a dream team. She can't stop praising you. The whole world does. I'm going to take her out for lunch and let her know what proud father she made me. Oh, that's sweet. What did I get? Hey, tell. Miss Lady, clear your calendar for this week. Great. Well, don't thank me just yet. Maya and I need you to help organize Kim's birthday. Maya is overwhelmed with organi organizing to be sunny, so am I. In a bloody nightmare, I forgot he's British. Planning a party of this magnitude isn't easy, Miss Lady. Logistics, finding a vendor, transportation, catering, publicity. It's enough to drive someone totally insane. I'm happy to help. Ooh, Maya needs help planning Kim's birthday party, but what does she need to do and who's going to make her life difficult? What? Playing every episode. What? Who life difficult? Kim's? I don't care. Um, and this week, I am a beautiful fairy. And yeah. Per. Let's go to Hollywood. Yeah, let's go to Hollywood. Miss Lady, where have you been? Huh? Oh, I'm sorry, I didn't mean to read. Totally swamped with all this. I think I am a bit off more than I could chew. There's just so much to do. I've never planned a party like this before. I don't think I'm very good at it. I could really use your help with three things. Sure. First, I need your help finalizing the guest list. Secondly, I've been trying to find a really fun theme for the party, but I haven't been able to come up with anything. Maybe some of our guests you talk to have some ideas. I'll be sure to ask. And third thing, is that those paparazzi's creeps over there keep showing up wherever I go. They're trying to get deeds on Kim's birthday. Those guys over there? Okay then, listen here. Time to take a seat under the learning tree. The key to being a good paparazzo is subsist substantly okay boss so what's the special theme of kim's birthday going to be i see what you mean but honestly um i don't like kim more and more every time i keep watching keep up the kardashian at first i started liking her but now i can't stand her and that's in real life too did she no that was simon at the new party but okay bestie my baby, Miss Lady Hubby. I could tell the moment you walked in the room, the vibe shift. 
In a good way, of course. I hope so. No, Miss Lady, I know so. Ooh. Tell me, surely you did not come all this way just to change the vibes. Explain the party. Yeah, of course I'll attend. All you have to say is that you'll be there, Miss Lady. What should the theme be? The theme to Kim's party? It should be about seduction, of course. Seduction. Yes. Everyone should dress in their most seductive outfit. Whoever has the most seductive outfit wins. Who determines this? You and I, of course. I like it. I know you would. In fact, perhaps we could have a pre preview later on. Wait, who is that stranger coming towards us? Ethan, oh my god, bro. There you are. Oh god, it's you. Where's my invitation, huh? <coughs> oh my god, he literally just changed his hair. G-Day, mates. You gotta be kidding me. Wait, you're there with the wig? You're the press? Come over here. Do I have a story for you about this dumb party? Match made in heaven. Girl, you can talk all you want. You ain't getting nothing. We definitely not invited her. She can spill anything. I'm sorry if this portion of the video is very short. Um, I just went to people that aren't important, but my baby happy is. And Willow kind of is because like every time she's in, like in the video, she makes it juicy. I just have to keep this portion of the video, but the other clips of me going to other people asking about the theme and going to the Kim's party will not be. Sorry. <laughs> Ooh, you and Kim arrived in the party already in full swing. You mingle with Rao, Hubby, Ro, and the other guests. And suddenly you remember, there's supposed to be a theme party. What was that? Hey, Miss Lady, what's up? Ask about the theme. What's going on? This was supposed to be a theme party. That's interesting. Maya never mentioned anything about a theme. Really? Suddenly the lights go out. <laughs> what? And when they come back on, you notice several guests are missing. Oh! <gasps> Kim, Miss Lady, we're going to play a game. A game. Yes. I bet you wonder what the theme of the party is, Miss Lady. Ye girl. I lie. The theme isn't just this party. It's for all of the next week. <gasps> so what is it? Maya laughs. We're going to have a Halloween horror mystery. <gasps> you wonder why I've been so busy this week, Miss Lady? It's because I've been setting this up. Throughout next week, someone involved in this party is going to start ghosting people. And when someone is ghosted, they ghost you. They disappear. Poof. Gone. No more. Oh no. Can Miss Lady, your job to figure out who's ghosting and people before they ghost everyone. Sounds freaking fun. I'm glad you think so, Miss Lady, because the mystery starts now. So keep your eyes and ears open because at this point, anything can happen. Oof. My, this is actually my best friend because she is so fun, bro. Like, pie, we're gonna figure out, we're gonna, they actually, like, gave us a hint for next week's. Hey, Miss Lady, that mystery thing seems pretty weird. Hey, no kidding. Definitely not what I was expecting when I flew to San Francisco. You're okay, though. Oh, yeah, I'm good. Just on my way to the airport. I just want to say, though, it was really nice to see you again. Oh, my God, please, please, please. Wait. Did you hear that? No? Hey, can I help? Raw? Excuse me? Hey, don't come closer. Stop. <laughs> the struggle, the audio breaks up. Uh, like two people are fighting over the phone. Suddenly you hear your name voice. Not real on the phone. Well, hello, Miss Lady. That's one down. Who are you? The call is dead. What, hap what is happening? Oh my God. 